AV compatible models in red and white. Coral 4B, 1 AV. 8,500 yen. This is the AV version of the 4B, 1 RB, 6,500 yen, but not only the unit but also the box is slightly different. Actual weight 2.1 kilograms. At first glance, I thought it was a plastic mold. It is a beautifully finished enclosure. Six sides are painted, and the baffle is a 12 mm thick solid board with a metal net inlaid in it. The other five sides are hardboard. It is a base reflex with a slit type duct, but the duct is also made of a 12 mm thick board. One sheet of glass wool. A countersunk nut is embedded in the rear panel, which is used when using a commercially available metal stand or when attaching a wall mount bracket. The unit is a 10 cm full range with a metal dome, for F, 1 wave 4 F, 1 RAV for wine red systems, and the main magnet is 85 times 15 mm. A smaller magnet is placed on top of this to cancel magnetic flux leakage, and the hole is covered with a magnetic shield. The frame is pressed steel plate, but it is heavy at 1 kg per unit. The output sound pressure level is 90 dB, the same as the 4B-1 using 4F-1, but since the magnetic circuit is different, it should be a little higher. The efficiency is quite high when viewed with a spectrum analyzer. It is nearly 10 dB higher than Greenwich. There is nothing you can do about the lack of bass, but this is sufficient for TV audio. In the author's study, a 7 cm two-way Super Mini is enough for a 27-inch CRT. When playing with a homemade 16 cm three-way, the V is inferior to the A. AV compatible two-way base reflex type. Coral EX 102 AV. 20,000 yen. AV compatible compact speaker. Heavy for its size, weighing 4.5 kilograms. Black painted finish with baffle on both sides with R for a luxurious feel. Base reflex with paper pipe duct. Baffle is 15 mm thick hardboard. I think the other five sides are the same. The woofer is a pressed steel frame, weighing 1.7 kg. The main body is made from pressed steel plate, with an aluminium flange with a metal net layered on the front and attached with hard screws. The magnetic circuit is AV compatible with a double magnet and magnetically shielded cover, the cover measuring 107 phi x 42 mm. The main magnet is probably 90 phi x 15 mm. The cone is thought to be polypropylene with carbon graphite. The tweeter is 0.5 kg, a hard dome with a tangential edge. It has an aluminium frame and double magnet, but no magnetically shielded cover. The main magnet is 65 x 10 mm, the sub magnet is 65 x 8 mm. The network consists of three cord coils, two film capacitors, and one electrolytic capacitor, and is covered with felt on five sides. The output sound pressure level is low at 88 dB, but it is not that low in actual measurements. This can be seen clearly when compared with Tannoy. There is an AV equalizer switch, which drops sounds above 8 kHz when turned on. The spectrum analyzer was taken at 1M, with AV and on OFF double exposure at both listening positions. The sound is bright and crisp, but if you don't need to use it close to the TV, the EX101, which is the same price, is a better choice.